Let's do it. Welcome one and all to Graveyard Keeper, and may I wish you all a happy Halloween. Yeah, I decided to do this for my Halloween video, just because why not? It's fun, it's seasonal, it's not even Halloween when I'm recording this, but that doesn't matter, because it doesn't matter when I'm recording this. October 18th. <laughs> I really gotta get that cough taken care of. I do have the DLC, the one that's currently out. There is one scheduled to come out on the 28th. So, be ready for that. Loading! Still loading! You can do it. I believe in you. Any day now. Actually, I need to pull myself some tea since this loading screen is going to take a while. Apparently, I have time for that. Oh, I'm impatient. I am very, very impatient. voiced or not. It is not voiced. Especially when you know that someone misses you. Oh. And that's why you don't stand in the middle of the road, children. What happened? Where is everything? Calm down. You're merely turning the page in your life. A whole new chapter awaits you ahead. But I need to go home! Can I go home? No. Well, there is a way you get home, but you're dead, by the way. Your new home is a graveyard, because you're dead. You are very, very dead. It means you're a graveyard keeper now. But I need to go home to my love. Not my problem, buddy. <laughs> I'm a terrible person, if you couldn't tell. You should dig up Gary. He'll help you sort everything out. <laughs> Who? What a strange vision. What is this nightmare? Okay, let's go find Gary. New task, okay, omnidirectional movement. This seems a lot like Stardew Valley, but... Ooh, a basement. The hatch is closed for now. Oh, that seems like a nice place. Another chest. Place for stones. Yeah, looks like I got a bit of work to do. Holy shard, I'm a skull. Are you Gary? Hmm. Why would you think I'm Gary? A man with red eyes told me to meet the to dig up I need to dig up Gary. A red eye. Oh I remember. Oh shard, that's right. I'm Gary. How'd you find me? Man told me that you'd be able to answer all of my questions. Good, but let me ask you, who are you, and where the shard are we? Sard are we, excuse me. I must be dreaming. None of this can be real. Hmm, so you're the new graveyard keeper. What else do you remember? Let me, what else do I remember? Let me think. 
I remember that sound. Let's go check it out. Everything is so strange. None of this makes sense. I definitely remember that bell. And a donkey. Okay. A... So I'm running a graveyard. Got a fresh corpse from the town. A talking donkey. Wow! A talking donkey! You, you can understand me? Let's talk! Who are you? I'm cheap labor. This card isn't mine, so I have to work for the car capitalist bastard who owns it. <laughs> Says the people who are selling this game, and I only earn five carrots a day. You're an animal. The situation is deeply humiliating. You know where I'm coming from, right, comrade? Oh god, he's a communist talking donkey. <laughs> the bastard pretends that he doesn't understand anything I'm saying. Well, he probably doesn't. <laughs> anyway, I need to get back to the town. You get rid of this one, I'll bring you a new one. What a strange land this is. Yeah, the communists. Damn commies. <laughs> Death is a preferable alternative to communism. For what? I feel like we should take it to the morgue. Don't exactly remember why. But I'm pretty sure it'll be fun. It might be profitable. Oh, I'm gonna be pure. I'm going to puke. Let's do it! I'm doing voices and I'm geeking. And my voices are inconsistent. Into the morgue. Shard. I like this place. Feels like a home. Put that body on the autopsy table for me. What's next? Oh yes. Slice some flesh from that corpse. That should be good for starters. What? No! This isn't right! Sure, sure. It's not right. How am I how could I forget? Because I'm a talking skull with amnesia. <laughs> Is that right? You don't know where you are. Is that right? That I'm a skull. Nothing is right here. So shut the hell up and do what I tell you. You promise you'll tell me how to get home? You just need to trade the meat in the village tavern for a beer. What? Human flesh. <laughs> Talking skulls never lie. <laughs> then you can bring me a beer. Okay. You've unlocked a new technology and got preparation place, a pallet, and flesh. Extract flesh. Oh, I'm guessing this is the autopsy table. Oh, I'm gonna be sad. That's, that's 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 nasty. You've unlocked new technology and got burger, sandwich, and baked meat. That's disgusting. I agree. You'll get used to it. So what should I do with the corpse? I don't know. I say bury it. Take the corpse, and I'll wait for you in the graveyard. Oh great. Okay, there's fog. This is indeed fog. I have no idea what I'm doing. <laughs> so you get to see me stumble through the tutorial. Happy Halloween if I haven't said that already, which I have. Hey, the door kind of looks like a face. Can't be the only one that sees this, right? That door's totally a face. That is. Totally a face, a door face. Bury it. Okay. Use the blueprint desk at the graveyard. Mark a site as a grave, and dig it with your shovel. Carefully put the body or re remains of it in the grave. <laughs> Bury and decorate. Warning: Do not use goat 
skulls, and upside down stairs as decorations. <laughs> Do not use goat skulls or upside down stars as decorations. No Satanism. Got you. He's your boss! Hello, preacher man! Oh. oh, I know. Ask him about this burial certificate. He should know something. I'd rather leave now. I'll be in the morgue waiting for my beer. Dear me, I'm so tired. Why? Why do I have to come here every week? Hello, preacher man. Oh, keeper, there you are. Yeah, I guess that's me. I'm sorry to have to tell you this, but your graveyard is a mess. Oh, yeah, no, I just got here. There's no way I'm promoting you to cleric until you fix it. Okay. So I gotta take care of Grace. Wooden marker. Okay. It's part of my duty, the unpleasant part. It's kind of an old tradition. I don't know much about all these traditions and rituals. I'm just here to represent his mighty and glory. Oh, oh. I have one tiny question. What is a burial certificate? Oh, as soon as the body has been laid to rest, you can trade its burial certificate for money at the village tavern. What the fuck kind of place is this? I'm not the keeper. I was going home from work and I got hit by a truck. I need to go home. There's a talking skull. He forced me to butcher a corpse. <laughs> a fine joke. I'm a humorist one myself. Here's one. Who is BB? Who? I am. <laughs> Big Bishop. Blessed and beautiful. Okay, I'll laugh, humor him. Well, how can I fix the graveyard? Just repair all the graves. It wouldn't take me even an hour. But it's your job. Okay, so repair graves. Okay, I've already done that. Okay. Okay. Okay, and then I can unlock... Oh my god, this is a lot! I think I'm gonna like this game. Access inventory. Okay, 
Okay, that's just digging it up. wants me to build a grave marker for the poor schmuck I just buried. There's a farm, so I'm guessing that's where I'm going to be growing my food. There's a day-night cycle, which I kind of gathered. By the order of the Great Inquisitor, this path is closed until... That time. I don't think this would be anything I cover. This would probably just be something I do in my own time. But, you know, it seems like a fun game. Creepy, macabre, and kind of messed up game, but a fun game nonetheless. Hey, V Lodge! Well, this must be the Tavon. Welcome to the Dead House Tavern. I'm Hordrick. How can I help you? I came from the graveyard. I woke up there today, and things have been crazy ever since. Oh, sorry. How could I not have recognized you? Good. This is good. Things are looking bright for our small village. You are planning on opening the church, right? I need to fix the graveyard first. Sure, sure. It's been a while since anybody took care of it. Let's get down to business to defeat the Huns. I couldn't help myself, shall we? Uh. I'm short on money. Okay, so I have to open the church. Okay. Okay, the mailbox by the church. Okay. Guy called Snake. I think he has a fake royal stamp. I haven't seen him in a while. Okay. Southeastern corner of the village. I have n no money. So I don't I don't even know what I'm doing. That's kind of my problem with Star had with Stardew Valley too. I had no freaking clue what I was doing at the beginning. Chiming phone. Oh, here's inventory. Oh, great! Tools have durability. Nickel Fritz. 
Never was a fan of that. I have absolutely no idea what I'm doing. And it's getting kind of late. I have work in the morning, don't you know? And my work entitles me to get up at 4 o'clock in the morning. so real. And everybody's okay with me just peering out of nowhere. <laughs> Shit! You're stealing my thoughts! <laughs> stealing? <laughs> I remember, there's a cellar in your cottage. Some provisions must have been stored there. Okay. <laughs> Wheat! Exactly! I remember baking bread out of it. And pies! Mmm. Sweet berry pies! <laughs> Toast! Onion toast! Oh, that's good with beer! Shit, you know what? I need beer! This is the beginning to feel like a one-sided relationship. Bring me beer, and I'll tell you a lot of important stuff. Like how you can get home. Questions? What about this road? Sard, you smart ass. Oh, his name is Sard. I'll be waiting for that beer as my reward. Oh, great. And this is my farm. can't claim the property yet, even though it's in my graveyard. Building. Use a blueprint to access the building interface and start building or removing an object to that area. Okay. I can't build anything yet. Place wood logs and that's place stones and this is my cottage. What was that sound? Zombies? Damn gate. I'll come here every night if I have to, but I'll eventually get through. <laughs> Looks like I can remove this blockage and fortify the arch. But I don't have materials to do that. Looks like how I get materials just by tearing this up. I'll at least get something going before I end the episode. Some flour. trunk in the cellar. I can expand my cellar out, no matter what I get access to the other one. But I don't have enough materials. Okay, I need logs. The bureau. Chest.
and I can cook. I can just fuel the fire. From coal, firewood, and sticks. I can make bread, and I can cook meat, okay? And I can just go right to bed. And that recovers energy. And I can control when I wake up and when I go to sleep. Okay, I like that. I'm so refreshed. This is not good. Not good at all. Who do you think you are? I'm the new graveyard keeper. Hooray! A kipper. Well, I've been here for so long. I'm, I'm York. I'm lonely. Poor, poor me. It's too bad you're here. Wait, no. On the contrary, I'm very glad to see you. But we do have a rather unpleasant fellow buried here. We'd really like to have a new neighbor instead. Is that like something you can up with? I'm not exactly sure why I'm here. Gary only told me that about burying bodies. You're York and he's Gary. Funny. A half-dressed skull? A jealous bastard. He can only dream of what a peaceful rest we're having. Oh, who am I kidding? It's terrible here. Especially that guy down in the lower right corner grave. He's mean. Did you just get rid of him? Just dig him up and throw him in the river. I can even give you this license that I stole back when I was alive. What license? You're such a dummy. To dig up a corpse, you need a license. The old keeper used to buy them through the mailbox near the church. Okay. You know what? I think I'm done. So thank you all for watching. Hope you have yourselves a wonderful Halloween. And stay creepy. But I'm the Dark Seraph. Signing off. That was my impression of a ghost. It wasn't very good. I'm sorry. Very, very sorry. <laughs>